Hi. Hi, everybody. Hey, guys. Hello. How are you? So we've been getting a little bit bored not seeing all of you guys all the time at school. We kind of miss you. So we'll put this little video together to show you some things we've created. Mrs. Whitman, what do you do when you're feeling bored? Well, besides cleaning, I put together a whole list of different kinds of activities for you guys to do. So on our class page that we started, it's called, I'm bored, what can I do now? Um, on here, I have a lot of different, um, here's my computer right here, showing you some of the things I have. Anime, videos, how to draw anime, what to make at home with things that you can find around your house, um, different digital art sites, and some of my favorite apps for making art on the computer, and lots of drawing videos and links for you to get on when you're bored. That sounds so Miss cool. King, what are you doing? What? Sorry, what? <laughs> what are you doing on your page? Gotcha, all right guys, hi. It's good to talk to you again. This is my bunny, Midnight. The fourth and fifth graders actually helped me name him. Um, so that's pretty cool. He's just hanging out with me. Um, but on my page, there is a few different type of STEM experiments and activities that you can do. Nice. Starting with roller coaster science. And there's a link to a YouTube channel, a YouTube video about a man who built a roller coaster in his backyard. So it's pretty awesome, pretty awesome stuff. Then there's also a really fun science experiment with just a few things that I know you have at home. So you can do that and you can either post the picture to let me see how your experiment went for you. Or I challenge you to just teach someone in your own home about the experiment and watch them do it too. It's really cool. Thanks. What about you, Jess? I've created a whole bunch of pages. There's recipes. There's things you can do through code.org. And then I really like playing board games. And I know a lot of you, when you come in my room, like it too. So I found links for some of the board games that you can play online. And also ones that I could print out stuff for you. I put it there so you could like print it out and check them out. Um, oh, that's Addie who just joined us from the window. And Zeke's here in my lap. Um, Sometimes they don't want me around anymore. Addie's gonna take over the screen. Um, <laughs> Zeke got annoyed with me last week and ran away for like a day and a half. But anyways, we hope you guys can jump on our page. It should be right in your list of classes that you're linked to on class pages. Um, if you have any questions or anything, you can email any one of us and we'll help you out as best we can. You also can message us through Unified Classroom because we have you all listed as our students. We would love to hear from you. you. What's that? Um, I started an Instagram page for you guys to share your artwork. And um, I'm starting photography challenges. So that's open to adults. And I hope that you guys, Annie and Jess, will participate. So I'm putting out little challenges you can do. Um, this week we're doing nature photography. So I hope you can get outside, take some cool pictures, and post them on Instagram. It's called Seneca NY Art on okay. Instagram. Okay. I'm going to so, go you right now, Ms. Whitman. All right. Sounds good. I started an Instagram account so I could do it. <laughs> um, all right. So, guys, we miss you. And if you have any questions, please get a hold of us through email or message us through class pages. We hope we see you really soon, and we hope you stay safe. Okay. Stay safe, everybody. Bye-bye. Bye. -bye. Bye. Bye.